loyalies and welcome to Let's Play Yogbox. Um, back in Minecraft due to request of a chappy by the name of Connor as it happens. He's my, one of our new loyalies. Um, this will not be replacing Fable. I will be doing this alongside Fable. And yeah, so this is the Yogbox. I've never actually played this one, the Yogbox, so I have no idea what I'm doing. This texture pack sort of came as part of it as well, and there's a book which is the crafting guide or something, I believe. It tells you all the recipes from the yog box, which is fantastic because I don't know them. Yeah, there's lots of stuff. So this is going to be fun, kind of. It's going to be a new experience for us both. Anyway, one of the features about the yog yog box is things generating like that. This is where I spawned. I have no idea what that is. But as it generated, my screen shook. I had a freaking earthquake. That was unusual. Hey, Mr. Sheepy. Look at the sheep. Look at the sheep. Yeah. So yeah, this is the yog box, and on this we are going to be doing stuff. I haven't decided what stuff yet, and also I need to start my timer. Hang on. Hold up. Hold up. Uh. I've lost my timer. Where's my timer gone? There's my timer. Uh, 15, 16 minutes. 16 minutes is good. Uh, there we go. And it's going. Uh, yeah, <laughs> very professional of me. I know. I'm, I'm, drink I'm also drinking a uh, strawberry milkshake is my choice of drink for this particular start starting of the adventure. And what the fuck is going on with that sheep's face? What the hell? I, I shall put you out of your misery. That shit was weird. Yeah, normal sheep face. That's better. That was creepy, creepy sheep. Okay. Well, I suppose the first thing we should really do is explore. I know you can do... There's a button I'm supposed to press with... Never mind. I don't know what the hell that did. There's like a button I can press and get a decent sword that will sort of level up with me and stuff. Obviously not that button. Uh, oh, I, can, that's, I like being able to set waypoints. Um, no village closer. Oh yeah, there's the villagers, millionaire and stuff. Never mind. <laughs> oh, there we go. So do I want dagger, sword or big sword? Well, bigger is always better. Well, hey, we have a big sword. Kind of. And it appears to have some kind of enchantment on it, although I don't know for what. Or what button I pressed either, for that matter. <laughs> it wasn't Q. Q throws it away. Was it E? No, obviously not. Oh, there we go, see? And then we can level it up and stuff, which is cool. Yay! Level up, uh, we'll level up not back a little bit, there we go. And I've got no more levels to do anything else with. But there we go, we have sword. This is the sword that is going to follow us on our adventure. Die evil sheep! You're not an evil sheep, you're dead anyway. So let's see what the fuck this is! This is, ooh. This is different. Also I have three hearts, so hopefully there's not much alive in here. Ooh, is that iron and gold blocks? Mine it, mine it, mine it, mine it. Oh, probably can't mine with a wooden pickaxe. We'll get a decent pickaxe and then I've got an unlimited supply of gold and iron. Which means I can upgrade my armor soon. I feel bad about taking out the floor of this place though. It's kind of an epic place. There's signs all over the place and all. Oh, that's lapis, isn't it? Wow. And this is just randomly generated. Okay then. I'm looking at the mini map as well, it's really impressive. So what have we got here? I'm guessing these are people who have donated to the development of whatever mod spawned this fucking thing in. <laughs> yeah, I don't know what mods are involved in this. I don't know where my sword has come from. I probably should have gone for the smaller sword in retrospect. Just because it seems to be taking up a lot of my screen. Yeah, let me I'll help. Yeah, no, now it's just taking up a bigger section of the screen. 
If I can craft a small sword, a uh, wooden sword, I shall, I shall do that. Support on the forums. Armor graphics. What armor? Admin armor. Building maker. I'm assuming this is then. Skin maker. What? I have my own skin. Creator of the Japanese culture. I doubt that a lot. Mod creator. What mod? <laughs> I wonder if this just naturally spawns at your like when you start a new world. And we're back. Okay, so I generated the new world and this monolithic structure or whatever it is did not spawn right next to me, so yeah. Um Right. I also took the opportunity to have a look at uh, the regular sword, you know, as opposed to this thing, and to be fair, it wasn't actually that much smaller. So, I'm, I'll stick with this. What else have we got here, anyway? Hall of Fame, Mayan culture, no you didn't, Indian skins. Ah, oh, this will be all to do with the uh, millionaire mod, maybe? I don't know. Japanese village. All right, we get the idea. Lots of people have been thanked. Yeah, you you everyone's thanked and stuff. But this room, this building here, this monolithic structure is literally just a monument to all the people who have worked on it. Okay then. Moving swiftly along. This game is about exploration so uh, now and so there's going to be a lot of exploration involved. That is haste by the way, isn't it? Yeah, I am running a little bit faster, I think. I can't really tell. Yeah, yeah I am. Not much, but enough. This is quite an impressive structure for a few people's names. I do wish I'd had a better pickaxe though, I could have at least got the iron. Gold one, I know the gold's not much use, but I could have got the iron. Sheeps. I also don't know which version of Minecraft this is anymore. Pumpkins! Coal! We, need, we will grab this coal, I'm assuming that's coal. I don't know this texture pack. Yes, that's coal, okay. There's some... Um, Cobblestone as well to ooh, Thorncraft is in this mod pack. We know Thorncraft, don't we, guys? Anyone who watched my Tekkit series is aware that I'm very, quite familiar with Thorncraft. And there's some awesome, awesome stuff in Thorncraft, which is going to make this very much fun. Uh, I also know that the Mo Creatures mod is a part of this, and Millionaire mod, uh, NPC villages. Um, there's an another village. The fuck? Who's going? Oh my god, it's polar bears. I also know that this mod is in it, whatever the hell that is. Uh, yeah, and I'm liking like crazy. Let's turn hang on, options, video settings, graphics fast. That'll do. That should help with my lag. Get some more cobblestone because I want to make a cobblestone pickaxe. Obviously I don't need to make a cobblestone sword, because I have a sword that's going to level up with me, apparently. <laughs> this is clearly still the older version of Minecraft, that not like the old, old version of Minecraft, because on the newer ones you get experience points for mining. Part of me genuinely thought I was about to die. Oh no, there's a tree capitator mod in this as well, which is very, very, very useful. Is that more coal? That's Enderman. I shall worry about getting more resources once I have some slightly better tools. I wonder, I wonder... No. Okay. Let's see if there's like a special pickaxe as well and stuff like that that could level with me. You know the same. Oh, Mr. Pig, why have you got wings? You're a flying pig, aren't you? Okay. You're dead now! Dead pig. 
And you shall die too. Die a horrible, painful death. Mmm, meaty. Thorncraft crystal! Hey! We like the crystals. They're useful for these. Uh, epic monolithic structure. And we're back where we started. I don't like being in a snow biome, to be perfectly honest. I would have uh, I would have preferred a jungle biome, which, ironically enough, when I generated the new world as a test, you know, to find out if that thing just spawns at your spawn point, I generate I appeared in a jungle biome. Right next to a town as it happened as well. Uh, uh, not an NPC village, but uh, like from Millionaire or something. Yeah. That happened. Um, ow. Yeah, three hearts. You get hearts. I know how to get more hearts though. You get hearts when you level up, like every five levels or something. I think. Possibly. Oh, and it's getting dark and I've got nowhere to hide and Mo Creatures is in, which means there's going to be so much coming out to try and kill me. This is going to be the shortest series ever. I've decided I'm going to finish the series when I die. No, I'm kidding. Uh, <laughs> that would be a dumbass idea because it would indeed be a very short series Let's get this tree here all your woods is mine see tree capitator mod awesome uh, yeah we wanted to make some stuff didn't we we <laughs> really could do with some sort of shelter first I suppose I could take shelter in that couldn't I zombies are out the 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 mummies the fuck are those well, they're out. Go on, Moon. Hurry up. Go from one side to the other. Hmm. Darkness in Minecraft. Yeah. So yes, we'll continue doing uh, Fable videos, and also every now and then I'm going to throw in a sort of random other, other gaming video, as I have been doing for my... Long time loyalties will have noticed this. Uh, I was going to bring out a Halloween special one, but I had uh, some, a few technical difficulties with that. I may still uh, d record a video of the game I was going to do just because it's an awesome game. And just release it as, as is. It's obviously not going to be a Halloween special, though. It would have been very appropriate for Halloween. So, um, for all of you who wanted to get a sneak peek and, you know, just nab the game in advance, it's, called, it's by Double Fine Adventures. Awesome, awesome people. And it's called Costume Quest. Which is a game about trick or treating. So, yeah, I figure that's appropriate. But did I just fall through? Oh, snow. Boop. Snowball, yay! <laughs> that snowball took a lot to get. Eh, yeah, Mr. Zombie. Oh, you're a brainy zombie. You're dead. Die. Die. Haha! <laughs> That wasn't a brain. What the fuck? All right. <laughs> I'm really gonna have to get used to this texture pack. What we got here? That's just the sheep. He's not a scary sheep. He's just a normal sheep. Oh, they're a little bit bad when they do that. I don't like hearing their legs break. When I try to kill animals, I try to do it humanely. Um, don't know what the heck you are, but you're going to die. But you sound like a zombie. Did you... Iron Helmet. You were an awesome zombie. I have apple from the tree, three rotten flesh. Yeah, we're doing quite well. Ooh, cow! Kill the cow! Kill the cow! Dead cow. Your life is increased by one and is fully replenished. Ta-da! I told you five levels got a heart. Whoop! Um, disadvantage of this is at the moment I am very vulnerable and likely to die very easily, which means I want to avoid things like him. As he can get me from a distance and stuff and will. Um, advantage of this though, apparently, and I'm not 100% on this, but I can get more than the usual amount of hearts. I believe you. Let's see, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Yeah. You get 10 hearts normally in vanilla Minecraft. And. In this one, I can get up to 20 hearts, which is awesome. Hey, don't run away from me. I'm, not, I'm, I'm nice. Ha uh -huh. I kid. I lied. I lied to you, you unfortunate creature of burden. Beast of burden. Dead. Ha! Anyone else? Anyone else? Want some? Want some? 
No, I don't imagine you do. You would probably run away if you knew what was coming. Yeah, that's what was coming. You did! Dead sheep. I'm just getting sort of basic resources at the moment, you know. Bits and bobs, food, wool, wool for making bed with, etc, etc. Ah, get dead. You are an ex-sheep. Hey piggy. Hey piggy. Food. Not liking the look of my surrounding areas at the moment. There's a lot of things that can kill me. There's a desert over there right next to a snow biome. And why not? You did. Nom. That actually looks like bacon, doesn't it? It just occurred to me. Hmm. Bacon. Uh, let's kill this zombie. What the hell is that? Is that just another zombie over there? I hope so. Yay, zombie brain. That's useful for research purposes. You're just a bog standard zombie, aren't you? Lag. Not even lag. Crash. Have I crashed? What's going on? Oh, there we go. Ah! Oh, a village or something spawned near me. I'm guessing. I don't even know. Okay, let's keep heading west. Ooh, house! Somewhere to hide! Hide from the night dangers and nasties. That iron helmet that that previous zombie dropped, I have no idea if that was actually part of the mod or if it, this version of Minecraft is just that. Whoa, what are you? I had a horrible feeling if I didn't kill you quickly, you would have killed me quicker. Yeah, I don't know if it was part of a mod or if it was just part of mine. So, okay, we have a village. Yay! Go here. Six buildings. Cool. Okay then. Hello. Uh, I'm a stranger. Oh well. Hmm. Right. I have no idea what that, any of that meant. That's the whole cre uh, creationism, mod, creationist, mod, creationist, creationist mod. The whole village is a millionaire, etc. I've never looked into any of this before, so I have no idea about any of it. Um, I shall end this episode here, though, and pick up from here straight after. In fact, in my case, it's going to be like immediately after, because I decided I would like to continue playing for a little bit. And uh, I shall see you all in a bit. Bye bye.